welcome to Jake Showcase. I do videos on Wednesdays. Well, I know the long intro there was because basically I wanted to show you one of the places I'd love to come uh, to sort of relax. And that place is beautiful, uh, Springbank Park. And what I do is, you know, sort of ever since I've been, you know, on YouTube, a lot of times I like to, you know, kind of find spots where I can be by myself and uh, just relax and I thought I would at least let you know while it's still beautiful out and I'll show you where I like to go so I got my two bananas here and we're gonna and I got my water and let's go so Springbank Park might be uh, London Ontario's most famous park uh, it's got uh, storybook gardens on it and uh, one of the reasons I really like it is because it tends to be a congregation place for Canadian geese and uh, as I've said before, I really like them. But usually when I come here in the afternoons, I just sort of like want to just space out um, and enjoy the green while it's still green. So this is see here. This is up here. And it's got tons of places. But where I like to go is I like to go to um, sort of in behind where you don't uh, run into anybody a lot. A thing too is like in the middle of the afternoon, this is like when people aren't aren't around as much. Usually towards the evenings, there's more people. So if you want to enjoy the beautiful green and you want to have some peace, the time to come is sort of midday, like I am now. It's around uh, getting close to three o'clock, right? So I what I do is I just basically walk, and I've got this certain particular area that I like to go to get on a park bench, and. Uh, so we're just going to walk there now. So over there, if you can see, there's some geese. Uh, usually there's a lot more than that, so they must be somewhere else today. A lot of times I'll just sit and sit with them. And I do that because I find that they really calm me down. There's a real calmness about them that I really like. Right? So, but today I don't think I will. Today I think I'll just... Just go over to my bench, right? Soon all these trees here are gonna go to the colors of fall. Right now it's all, uh, September 16th and they haven't quite started, they started to change a little bit here. But for the most part, it's still quite green. And yeah, so I'll just uh, keep walking down here. Okay, so this is where I go, down through here. And the thing I like about it too is like, you know, this is on the far kind of edges of the city. So, a lot of people do bike and rollerblade and walk down here, walk their dogs. But, I'm not here to look for, look, you know, be with people. A lot of times when I go downtown, I want people to see me. But usually at this time, like nowadays, I just like being sort of to myself. And so I go down here to this little path, right? And once in a while somebody will walk down here, but most people want to go on like the main, you know, cemented areas of the town or of it because so, they're doing like their, you know, bike uh, trail. So I usually spend about, I don't know, maybe 45 minutes, an hour down, down here, maybe half hour. And then, after I just sit and relax on, see, there's that bench. There's the bench I like, right? See how nobody's back here? It's cool. Some people jog through here for like cross country and stuff like that, and you can't really see the water, but a little bit later I'm gonna walk down and I, I like to take a look at the water and I'll show you that. But this here's the bench I like to sit on, right? because there's nobody here <laughs> and you get to look at green see some and I've actually made friends with a chump monk or I don't know if we're friends but he's not afraid of me like he used to be and uh, so and sometimes mosquitoes are dying down but sometimes the mosquitoes right like they they come too so yeah so I just sit here and I always have, I try to have two bananas, right, and I usually have two in the night, right, so, 
And by the way, uh, I'm sticking with the organic bananas. I just find that, uh, you know, it's a good little snack. So, yeah, so this is what I like to do by myself, right? <laughs> Enjoy and look at this guy. And I'd like to show you, I'd like to show you the second section too after I finish this. So it'll just take me a little while and then I'll, uh, I'll come back and we'll, we'll go for a walk down so you can see like the full, the full uh, river. I like it. Still chilling, enjoying. So uh, just a quick commentary. I was just thinking I just finished my first banana. You know, it, it's kind of ironic. It's like, you know, you go onto YouTube, or I went onto YouTube, right, so you get famous. But then, you know, ever since I got like, you know, over a million views and higher, right, it's like, I feel like everywhere I go, a lot of people know me. So it's like, then you don't want to be famous. Right, so you want to like be left alone, but it's kind of ironic how when you're one way, you wish you were the other way, and then when you start to go the other way, you want to just be peaceful and quiet. I've read about that, but over the past like year or so, like I've, I've personally experienced it. Like, it's like you know, you wanted the attention, now you have the attention, and now you don't want the attention. So, I guess, I guess what I'm learning about life is like you got to be sort of like content with what maybe what you have because you know the other side of it could be you know maybe not what you want or yeah so anyway just a, a thought usually when I eat I get like the blood sugars go and my brain start working again and I start thinking about stuff but yeah it's still gorgeous you heard those geese I, I didn't get to see any because we're sort of basically like in a little bush here my chipmunk buddy came out where is he? Oh, let's see. Oh, here he comes. Yeah, there he is. Hey, bud. How you doing today? Yeah. How's it going? Yeah. See, that's that's my buddy. Oh, he's coming back. Hey. Hey. Yeah. He's a little bit nervous today. But usually he comes right over and hangs it with me right here. Oh, here he comes back. Okay, so I'm done my bananas now. And, uh, let's grab the peels here. Okay, so after I'm done that, <clears throat> what I like to do is just go for a walk down the, um, the cemented part. And we go down to the dam. Or I go down to the dam. Right. See, it's beautiful out, eh? See, this is like uh, where most people come for the rollerblading and stuff like that. Got a nice willow tree there. Right. Let's keep walking down this. This pipe path goes really far. But we're just gonna go up to the dam. There's some geese there, hanging out, doing what I'm doing, just chilling. Go geese! <laughs> so now you can see, sort of like on the other side of the river. Right, we're still going up this path here. Right. Hear the ducks. Yeah. Sun. Right, you can start to see the dam right over there. We're gonna walk over, give you a full full view. Right? See the nice clouds up there? So anyway, I like it. Right? This is my style, you know, chill. You know, a lot of times, like when the. Oh, there's this one. A lot of times when, you know, it gets cold or it changes, it, it's not as nice, but, you know, take advantage of it while you can, especially in this early fall season. Right? But this place is, uh, you know, 
like I said, probably the most popular park, most well known. A lot of different events are held down here, raising money for different causes. And, uh, you know, it's very well kept. People are really, really nice that you talk to, right? It's just, it's a different scene than like the downtown crowd, right? It's just a little bit more, I don't know, just different scene. More my up my alley, I think. So, start to see these trees, and uh, just showing you around, I guess. I like it. So there you can start to see the water, right? Now the one thing about this dam is that the dam, it broke. Something to do with it breaking. And ever since, like, the water's been flowing through really nice. Um, so some people want to put it back up because when it's up, they could boat, boat around here. But then it wrecked a lot of the natural habitat and the natural flow of the river. And so basically... For the river's health, uh, at least you know it's it's just been down, which is a bit of a shame in one way because obviously it costs a lot to put it up, and uh, but in another way, you know, like I guess this is the way the river's supposed to go, so that's good. So people like coming down here still because, as you'll see, it's still spectacular views, right? And uh, we're getting close. Okay, so we're basically here now, right, and you, uh, you can go up to like this little area here that I go to pretty much every day that, well, I can, and on one side usually the ducks are, and one side usually the geese are. It's kind of weird how, at least that's a pattern that I've noticed, but check this out, eh? Look at this. See, there's the dam. Right, and it's open. Look at that. We're talking A plus or what? Okay, see this little spot here? This is where I like to sit. Right here or stand. Still got my banana peels here. I'm gonna throw them in a second. But look at this. Like seriously. Isn't that beautiful? Seriously, look at all the trees. And the reason I wanted to do it now was because I know that they're gonna start to, you know, change colors and they already sort of have a little bit. You can see like over there, it's like orange. It, there's a pigeon, right? And then a little bit of yellow over there, right? But see like the geese stuff usually flock around here. Actually, they both do, really. And uh, here's one thing I noticed just today too, like well, just for today. But you see there's just pollution in there. Some days it's there and some days it's not, so I don't really know why it comes not. But of course, you know, like you don't want to see pollution in the water, right? So, you know, I'm not an expert or nothing like that, so I don't know why. What that, what, you know, what's causing that, but still, I don't like looking at it, right? Just, okay, so look at that. Sometimes what you get to see is a herring, too, like a herring. In fact, look, I don't know if you can see way up there, there's a herring. I don't know if the zoom works here. Can you see that? I don't know if zoom works on a, but I see a herring standing on a rock, right? And I think, I'll tell you about herrings, why I really taken to the herring. The herring, unlike the goose, is independent bird. They like to just hang out by themselves. They have much bigger wings, long legs, and they snap like really quick when they're eating a fish. And the geese, what they do is they hang out in groups. But, you know, me personally, I'm much more like a uh, I don't know, probably more like a, I don't
don't know what happened. This is the first time I've ever zoomed. Um, I'm probably more like a herring than a goose because uh, I hang out by myself a lot. And But what happens is, is that when a herring sees another herring fly, like usually one other one, which only happens very infrequently, a lot of times the male will follow it, follow the girl. Girl one, I, that's what I assume is going on. So on the other side, it's still, it's still quite nice too, right? Right, it looks like there's more birds over on this side today, right? And uh, it's still quite beautiful, eh? I think it is anyway. So, I like some wild brush there. Right, and there's the trees. Right, and it's really nice too, like when the sun sets, because it'll set down. Right, and this is a nice way to. Hey, look, there's a herring again. There he is. Nice big, I don't know if that's a blue herring, it kind of looks blue to me. But, let's see if that zoom thing works again. Right? Yeah. So, I'll probably spend like about half hour here, 45 minutes until like my mind gets nice and calm. And uh, yeah, this is what I like to do. Right? That's all your troubles go away and that's your, yeah. Let's all your troubles go away and, you know, let's you think of new creative ideas and insights and think about your life and think about what you want to do next, you know, or, you know, what's happened and, you know, just goals you have. Yeah, so this is a Spring Bank Park in London, all right? And this is how I, I like to chill out. <laughs> all right, check it out sometime. All right. Thanks so much uh, for watching Jake Showcase. Don't forget to like the video below. Subscribe to the channel up above. I do my videos on Wednesdays. And I hope you have a wonderful day.